Hey everybody, it's your boy Chicken coming at you again with my ever-changing background. Um, I wanted to uh, bring up an idea that I had that uh, came across my mind um, when I was uh, going through um, going through my hangers and and trying to send something to somebody, and I had to scroll down and scroll down just to get past the ships, not to mention all the modules. So. And I'm looking at the ships like, I really should use these. Let me let me figure out a way to use them. Well, the truth of the matter is I've outgrown a lot of these ships. And in outgrowing them, I, you know, in, in the past, if I outgrew something else, I would either sell it or I would uh, salvage it to kind of, you know, whichever offered the best value for me. And I was thinking, what if NetEase added something like the ability to salvage our old ships? That would be really cool, but it's not something currently in the game. What can I do right now to extract value from those old ships, besides the past experiences I had and, and how they helped me to get to today? So my thought was that what if there was a way to, I should say my problem is, that I want to find a way to have fun in these ships or to make ISK off these ships. Now, there's only so many buyers for... Uh, you know, an, an old destroyer that I bought to fly around twice and never looked at again. There's, uh, it certainly doesn't have the same value as when I bought it. How can I do that? Well, I believe that I've found the solution to both the fun and the ISK problem. So I'll admit that I haven't started doing this yet, and I'm probably biting off my nose to spite my face by putting it out there and suggesting that people do it. But at the end of the day, I I think that this is a good enough idea. And to be honest, I um, waited till the last minute to put out a video. And this was the only thing that had been kind of mulling over in my head for the past week. You know, how can I do this? And I think I found a solution. What I suggest and what I'm going to do is going to be taking out all of my old ships and fitting them with a mediocre fit, maybe Mark 7, Mark 9, maybe even Mark 5. Um, you know, stuff that sells on the open market for less than 50K, as far as modules are concerned. Um, uh, assuming that it already has, uh, that it already has uh, rigs. If it doesn't have rigs, or if it has all prototype rigs, you can just skip, uh, skip the go have fun with it part and go straight to step two, which I'll get to in a minute. Excuse me. Now, uh, go ahead and fit your ship out. Mediocre fit. The whole point of this is to keep the IP as low as possible. You take that ship out and you go have fun with it. You go PVE for a little while and stuff you maybe shouldn't do in that size of a ship. You go and do some PVP in an incredibly hostile area. Whatever it is you decide to do, the goal is to have fun and blow up your ship. Once the ship is blown up, do not claim it where you are closest to. Instead, look at the market, look for the buy orders in the market, and then you'll see the station. Go ahead and set your destination for that station and go there, and that's where you claim the insurance for it. Now, whether you have to wait 12 hours or whether it's immediate, once that has come to fruition and is unlocked, then what you do is you go back to that same place. You go sell, sell now, and you'll be able to get the ISK by selling the ship to Concord, effectively erasing it from the game. Everybody's all up in arms about how insurance creates all these things, but nobody's taking the time, or very few people, I should say, are taking the time to go and and put the ships back into the ether. The other ones came from the ether, now uh, we can put them back into the ether, and Concord is nice enough to give us money for it. Well, ISK. Uh, so, um, that was what I wanted to go over today, and um, like I said, you can skip straight to step two. Let's say that you have a ship that doesn't have rigs, or it has prototype rigs, or you don't care about the rigs, you're not trying to extract them, then you can just take that ship, fly it over to wherever it goes, repackage it, and then... Um, and then do the sell now trick. Um, the, <clears throat> excuse me, it's not even a trick, it's a feature. Use the sell now feature. Um, now, again, I want to reiterate that the IP value for these ships should be small. If you can't sell the ship, 
then that means that its market value is incredibly low. And instead of putting it on the market, trying to undercut everybody else who also is undercutting you, why not just skip this, skip the bartering step and go straight to somebody who will give you a set value for it? Sell it to Concord. Okay, I hope that this has been helpful. Uh, thanks again. I am pushing for the 500 subscriber mark so I can start giving doing giveaways for uh, Omega Game Time. Um, I am uh, quite a bit of ways off of that, so in this video I'm just trying to uh, hit that 150 subscriber mark. Um, I think I set the goal last time, but I only typed it to a couple people. So if you are watching this video and you're not subscribed, it would be super amazing if you could. And, um, and it benefits you because I'll be able to do giveaways. Um, thanks again uh, for taking the time to watch this video, and I hope you have a wonderful week.